Hi Flosstube, my name is Becca and this is Sambri Stitches. It's a special edition video. I literally, oh, Carl says hi if you can hear the rooster. <laughs> um, I literally just got home from work, walked through the door because I knew that my autumn equinox box from Brandy at Be Stitch Me arrived. It got a little damaged. Um, I only just cut the tape, so I don't know what's, well, I kind of do know what's in here. A little PSA before I do the unboxing. Most of you who watch the unboxing videos generally want to see what's in them because you didn't buy them or you want to know for future boxes. Um, if you happen to watch this and you do um, have the box and you post contents, please try and post a spoiler picture first, especially on Instagram. I am sick. I have a little bit of a head cold. It was a rough day at work and I was scrolling through Instagram and bam, somebody had posted the fabrics and then bam, somebody posted the entire box contents. No spoiler pictures, no nothing. So I put a little like PSA up in my Instagram stories that just said, please, if you're going to post the contents of any boxes that you get, post a spoiler picture because not all of us can stay off of social media um, waiting for our boxes. So not just Brandy's boxes, but any boxes you get. Just, just post a little spoiler picture before you post the actual contents would be much appreciated. Now, I didn't study the pictures. I saw them and noticed, you know, that it was Brandy's box in the, in the caption part of it and scrolled by. So still a genuine unboxing because I like to share my, you know, surprise and, and <laughs> Carl is going to be crawling through the whole thing. Um, just my surprise and uh, my joy with you guys. So here we go. Like I said, I cut the tape. That's it. So we're opening it and all the goodies are inside. So excited. All right, so I got the Epic Autumn Equinox box and I also got the 1 8th cut of 18 count Ada. Um, so Brandy puts in a little kind of like cheat sheet on here. Um, so it looks like there's gonna be some good stuff in here. First off, we have some candy. These are gonna go to my daughters because they love gummy worms. So these are trolley gummy worms and some other candies, but we don't need to go through all the candies. We're good with that. All right, so the first thing that is on the top are these beautiful floss drops. They're wooden and they're in leaves. Now I'm not a big floss drops person. I actually gave all of my floss drops to a friend of mine but now that I have a cool floss grinder that I bought from Stacy Stitches, um, I don't know why now, I, now I'm gonna start using these. I don't know why having that just made me wanna start using floss drops. Um, at least for my DMC, I keep my fancy floss on their cards. So, um, so there's that. And then a little pretty bag. I love these little bags. They're so pretty. So what do we have? Oh, we have a needle minder. Let me, let me open this. Look at that blingy needle minder. How pretty is that? And it's pretty cool. She even like cut out the paper in the shape of it too. Brandy's boxes are just always the best. I love them. And then a frogger with beautiful autumn colors. There's the frogger part. But look, there's a little acorn on the bottom, but look at the colors. Those are so, so pretty. Beautiful colors. This might be my new favorite frogger. Not that I like froggers, because we all hate frogging our work. If you don't know what frogging means, it's just kind of like ripping out stitches. Ribbit, ribbit, like a frog. Yeah. Um, this looks like a little, let's see what this is. It's like a little bag. How cool is that? That's pretty neat. And it's got like little pockets on the side. So 
like a little orc type of bag it looks like it could be which is pretty cool let me see if it says uh, I don't it's a cross stitch desk organizer by Allegro stitches that's my friend that's Amy look at that that's so cool very cool I will link um, Allegra stitches down below as well so you can go check it out oh cool a Mill Hill kit buttons and beads I love this it's so cute and it's you know Mill Hill kits they have everything in it and um, the little uh, plastic it's like plastic canvas type of stuff or perforated paper um, is what it is that's pretty cool my daughter stitched some ornaments on perforated paper and I helped her finish those um, kind of fun uh, what is this I'm not sure what this is is this a delaying tool let me see Uh, let me open it while I'm <laughs> this might be the laying tool I think yep it's a laying tool it just comes out of its thing oh cool look at that I don't have a laying tool look how pretty that is I've never used one very cool all right, is this the moment that we have been, oh wait, there's, let me do this thing first. This is the scissor fob. Look how pretty that is. And it's got a little tree. This is tree of life, I think, but it's perfect for autumn, but the colors are really pretty. I think, and I could be wrong, but I think that Brandy makes the, um, the, scissor fobs and the froggers and um the needle minder i think her and her daughter um because it doesn't say that they're by anybody and i'm pretty sure that we've talked about that before but i could be wrong but all right now to the good stuff let's see let's do let's do the bag first this project bag is by a and d designs uh-uh <laughs> pumpkins and sunflowers <coughs> excuse me still not filling 100 and then the inside is corn that's pretty cool love that and these are big bags too i think they fit they might fit my 11 by 11. they're pretty pretty good size sturdy bags Okay, now for the moment that we have waited for. Y'all ready for this? This is what I am most excited about with Brandy's boxes. Are um, the silks and the fabrics. Are y'all ready for the silks? I'm trying to organize these. There's eight ske skeins, skeins, whatever. I don't know how to say it. It's been a day. <laughs> Look at those colors. Look at those colors. Okay, so this is tea leaf. Look at the colors on tea leaf. Oh my gosh. Sage. Beautiful. Mud skipper. I love this. And most of the names um, of these, Brandy and her family come up with. Um, I've come up with some of the fabric names, um, but her family comes up with a lot of the cool ones. This is Tuscan. Elderberry. I love this one because I love purple. Acorns. That's a perfect acorn color. The sun is going down. I rushed home so that I could do this unboxing outside for y'all. This is Guardian. Boy, Carl is very vocal. He's very confused about what time of day it is. He crows in all of my videos, no matter what time I record. And then this is honeycomb. Love it. Love it. Okay. 
fabrics. Crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. So for fabric, let's see, there's four different colors and I got the eighth. So 18 count and this is Mabon. M-A-B-O-N, Mabon, Mabon. Look at that. Look at that beautifulness. Love it. Okay, fall foil, foliage. A <laughs> foliage, I don't know how to talk today. Look at that. I fold it in half so that you get kind of a better idea of the color just as, because the sun is going down behind me um acorns i love this one it's just a beautiful brown modeled fabric beautiful brandy knocks it out of the park with her fabrics and her silks and harvest i love this one too look at that Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I am so happy with Brandy's boxes. She always puts together amazing packages. Everything is stitching related. Everything is useful. Um, I like how she includes a lot of my friends too. I don't have any part of that, but it's kind of cool that, you know, that Amy was, it was part of it. That was pretty cool with the, the desk organizer. Um, I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. And um, I'm going to go and re-look through this stuff and organize it and kind of ooh and ah over it all over again. Um, and so until I see you all again, happy stitching everybody.